at this new support level that's well above $2,000, I do believe. And understand that in order to move the needle in the gold markets, this is a $10 trillion market, okay? Because once that price of gold starts ticking upwards, it is very hard to uh, bring back people's confidence in the system. What we do know right now is that we're entering the age of hybrid warfare. We're about to see the unleashing of sleeper cells on critical infrastructure on multiple fronts, whether they be from Russia, from Iran, from North Korea, from China, uh, we are very likely to see an escalation in terms of asymmetry in that respect in the near future. Now, Russia is increasing its military size by another 170,000 people, okay? So this is gonna bring their total armed forces to 2 million 209,130 units. Now there's been a cyber attack on Russia. Metrics show a major outage on Russian internet provider Ob Telecom. The incident is the latest in a wave of cyber attacks attributed to the IT Army of Ukraine hacktivist group. Now there's this. The Ukrainian armed forces are testing the strength of Russian air defense systems, launching drones at facilities uh, of the Ministry of Defense and the Russian Navy. Hey y'all, I need y'all to subscribe and smash that like button.